all the news you can use, this is Bravescast. My name is Colin Grad, a junior at Brown High School. Jimi Hendrix's song Purple Haze changed rock music forever. Jimi Hendrix is widely known for his unique guitar riffs, drug addiction, and changed the culture of rock music in the 1960s. <laughs> Jimi Hendrix struggled with drugs throughout his life. Many people say that his trips were the inspiration for many of his songs. However, he claimed the drugs did not assist him in writing Purple Haze. He said it was a dream he had where he was under the sea and a purple haze surrounded him. He wrote the lyrics for the song after Christmas Day in 1966. He went to a club in London and performed the beginning of the song where he caught everyone's attention with his unique guitar playing after that, they told him to write the rest. Jimi Hendrix is also known for his unique guitar riffs. He was left-handed, so he played his guitar upside down. This contributed to his unique chord formation and his overall playing. Before Jimi Hendrix was discovered, rock music was soft and included more basic chord structures. But after Jimi Hendrix, it was filled with these types of unique guitar riffs and his new way of playing guitar. He also changed the way people recorded music by using new techniques that everyone would soon copy. Excuse me while I kiss the sky. Jimi Hendrix changed the culture for young people. He also changed the way rock music was played. He changed everything about the rock culture for future generations to come. He also revolutionized how music was recorded by using new techniques, which included putting a pair of headphones to the mic to give the song a more full sound. He also changed the world by changing the rock scene. He changed the way the guitar was played and really made people realize what the guitar could actually do. Before Jimi Hendrix, people used to uh, put their guitar high up on their body, but afterwards, they put it down low and learned how to play like Jimi Hendrix. <laughs> I would like to thank the audience for listening. I would also like to thank Quora.com and FactSongs.com for providing me with some interesting facts. Tune in next time for more Bravescast.